Welcome to the Uncle's Channel. Thanks for watching today. And let's talk about a cheese the Tower Knight in Demon Souls. Now the game actually has a pretty good uh, predetermined path here if you just simply want to do it the way the game intended by going up and uh, slicing his ankles here, making him fall down and attacking his little headpiece. That's simple, but there's still a chance of getting hit by his shield or simply getting stomped on and of course losing the battle that way. But you didn't come here for the base strategy. You came here for the cheese strategy. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to have the Poison Cloud. If you don't have that yet, it's a very base magician stat. And you can get it even if you're a melee character. Super easy to use. And there's a little link up above here of a video of how to get the Poison Cloud. But all you're going to want to do is walk into the arena, throw out a Poison Cloud, and it immediately attaches to him. And once it immediately attaches to him, he's going to start losing health five points at a time. And you simply run up the stairs. And you can just wait here if you wanted the entire battle. And he'll lose 900 health. And then you go back down and throw out another Poison Poison Cloud, he'll lose 900 more, and then I think it's only two Poison Clouds will get him, but even if it's three, three Poison Clouds and you'll have him defeated in no time. Now while you're waiting for the Poison Clouds to take effect, I do recommend just going around and going and uh, fighting and taking out all the archers, because when you're going down there to reapply the Poison Cloud, they could attack you, so it's easy to go ahead and take them out, so just simply go around the perimeter and go ahead and take them out while his health is slowly depleting, and of course, all you gotta do is wait off to the side after this, and then once 900 health has disappeared, Go back down there, reapply the poison cloud, go back into hiding, and you'll have to do this step maybe two, possibly three times, and you'll have him defeated in just a few minutes. But it's a super easy strategy to do, pretty much guaranteed not to get killed, no combat involved, and a guaranteed victory. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to like and subscribe to the channel. Check out my other videos listed up above, and as always, go out there, find a great game to play, just simply have a great rest of the day.